Okay, freak out. So here's what you need to know about freak out. This is a very interesting piece because in the music it doesn't tell you exactly what notes to play. Okay, this is kind of like play a story. The main thing is the idea and the feeling that we get. Okay, and we get to improvise random pitches. So, we're going to start out with the right hand in this area and the left hand in this area. Okay, and we're just using our third finger in each hand. That's that's a nice balanced finger, right? Okay, so we need to have three beats for every, for every measure, so that is important. We have to have the rhythm right. So what the music is telling us, and I'm actually going to show you this music, it's telling us to start in a certain place, or a, a general place, I should say, and then move up. In the left hand, start in a general place and move down. Then play a big cluster and let it sort of die out. It's very interesting looking music, isn't it? Okay, so here's what we're going to do. So this is the general area for right hand, general area for left hand. Oops. And we just have to go one and two and rest. Okay, so that's the beginning. Again, we're just starting up in this area and going right, left. Then we move up and do right, left again. And then we wait. And then we play with our right forearm. That means your whole arm up to your elbow. And you play a whole cluster of notes. It's going to be in this area right here. Okay? So in the middle C area is where the bottom of your hand is. Okay? So I'm going to do that again. One and two and rest. One, two do that again. One and two and rest. One, two, three, hold, two, three. Second thing you have to do is you're going to start somewhere around middle C with your right hand. Your left hand is still around here where it was. You're going to do, you're going to introduce the same thing you just did. Okay, so it's a longer pattern and you're going to go up one more. So it's going to go like this. So if we're going one, two, three, rest, and one, and two, and three, and rest, rest. And then we come in with our left forearm, where the top of our forearm is going to be starting somewhere around middle C. And we go like this. And in this second part, the difference between the first part and the second part is that in the first part, we went right, left, right, left. In the second part, we start with our right hand and we go left, right after that. So it's and left, right, left, right, left, right. Okay? So let me play that with the big forearm cluster, okay? One and two and three and one and two and three and two and rest, rest. One, two, three, one, two. Here's the whole first two parts that I showed you, okay? Here we go. One and two and three and one and two and rest. One, two, three, hold, two, three, rest. And the first two parts put together. And this is loud, by the way. It's really loud. Okay, one and two and three and one and ready and go. And one and two and three. One, two, three, hold, two, three, rest. And two and three and one and two, three. third section, we're going to start out like the second section. We start around middle C with our right hand, and two, and three, and one, and rest. But this time we come back in on the third beat around that same place. Three, and, and now we do clusters like crazy. We go one, oops, 
moves and it's without pedal. Without pedal. One and rest. Two and three. Rest. Rest. And then you get to come down with both your forearms like this with pedal. And that's the whole song. What do you think of that?